obviously, on Mr. Young. You must have created some kind of hair growth formula. <laughs> I want to talk to the hair growing genius, and I'm guessing it's that guy rocking the Fu Manchu. <laughs> You're Preston Pickles. Like I told that guy. I'm a huge fan of your infomercials. What's your favorite? The tan shampoo? No. <laughs> <laughs> the condiment cufflinks. Regular or Dijon? Dijon, please. <laughs> Disposable, germ-free handshaker. Or <laughs> the Preston Pickles pit filter. It distills my sweat into fresh drinking water. <laughs> With your hair formula and my marketing genius, together we'll make millions, millions, I tell you, millions. Millions? Millions. I tell you, millions. <laughs> I needed hair today to be a big seller. Now how am I going to pay off that lawsuit for my beef jerky pants? <laughs> I'll be ruined. Ruined. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'll check his pulse. <laughs> and now on Mr. Young, where's my office again? <laughs> this map of Western High is of no use to me. <laughs> <laughs> Derby, what are you doing? I was napping. I am shocked and I figured it was canceled. Why? Because Mr. Manx lost an arm and a leg? In that real estate scheme? And decided to end his life? Here at Finnegan? Then moved to Africa to help children? Where he was attacked by a lion? What? That's the end of the story. He's dead. That's terrible. I was enjoying that story. <laughs> anyway, shop class is not canceled. You have a new teacher. Mr. Pickles. Derby. Nice to saw you. <laughs> saw me? Did I say saw? I meant saw. <laughs> he seems nice. Anyway, I'll be in your hammock. <laughs>